What is marketing channel? A marketing channel is a set of people, organization, and activities that work together to transfer goods, products, and services from one point of origin to the point of consumption. The primary purpose of marketing channel is to create a connection between the organization that creates a product or service and prospective consumers or customers that may want to purchase it. For physical product, there are four basic types of marketing channels, direct selling, number two, selling through intermediaries, number three, dual distribution, and four, reverse marketing. What is direct selling? Where products are marketed and sold directly to consumers without a fixed detail location. Selling through intermediaries that is where products are manufactured at the point of origin and sold to customers by downstream intermediaries such as agents, brokers, wholesalers and retailers, stores. Dual distribution is where manufacturers combine multiple types of channels to sell products to the end user. This could mean that the manufacturer sells directly to cons customers and also does businesses with wholesalers and retailers who sell to customers through their own distribution network. Where products move from the customer back to the manufacturer is the reverse marketing. Typical cases of reverse marketing include recycling and product records. Businesses are engaged in digital marketing campaigns, execute a special type of direct campaign that leverages many different types of channels to effectively Effectively market to prospects, nurture them through the sales funnel, and drive sales growth and revenue target attainment. Why are marketing channels important? As an organization prepares to bring a specific product or service to the market, it must develop and define the appropriate marketing mix that we use to promote its products in the market. An effective marketing mix must account for the four P's of marketing, product, price, place, and promotion. The first place of the marketing mix is the product itself. To succeed, a business must develop a product that customers want to purchase because it satisfies their need and offer features that they want. It must be designed to deliver great sell customer experience and effectively differentiate from competing brand with value-added features. The second element is pricing. The organization must offer the products at the price that can be justified by value of the product. Pricing should be competitive with similar products in the marketplace while accounting for differentiating factors and value that prospective buyers might attain to them or attach to them. When it comes to the financial elements, place and promotion, understanding marketing channel is crucial. To satisfy the third marketing mix element, place, an organization must understand where buyers are looking for their products and work to make their products available at these locations. Now, for many technology companies, customers will seek out their products online, that is direct selling. And from a retailer selling through intermediaries, the final element of the marketing mix is promotion. This with the identification of the best channel where an organization can best distribute messages about its products to its target audience. Promotion is especially important for organizations that do direct selling as they don't depend on retailers or wholesalers to drive sales on their behalf. Organizations that sell their products online must identify with the digital marketing channels that offer the best ROI for marketing dollars. The overall ROI for an individual marketing channel may tend to diminish over time as users begin to tune out or ignore advertising that they see all the time. In addition to, ad to identifying optimal channels for generating marketing ROI, organizations should continuously set new marketing channels while leveraging adverts, marketing automation to avoid sending repetitive message to the same prospects. Five digital marketing products. Five digital marketing channel for promoting your products. If you sell your products online, chances are that you are working with the direct selling mode or marketing channel. If your products can be distributed through the internet, there is no need to distribute through the internet. There is no need to build 
a distribution network of agents and retailers that can connect customers with the product. Rather, you focus, your focus should be on effectively promoting your product and driving sales through the appropriate digital channel and at the same time, you should look out for some things that are important. Targeting the right marketing channel with direct consulting is very important. How do you do it? First of all, you have to apply the customer generation methodology to optimize marketing spend and target the most profitable marketing channels, ensuring that customers achieve revenue targets while increasing marketing efficiency. Every time to seek out work in action, you need to custom, you need to work with a custom proposal so, so that you can work with the best. Uh -huh. And if you if you want to advertise yourself online, that is not bad as well. But most my main purpose for this video is just to tell you that marketing channels is a thing, and it is something to consider when doing business, about to start your business, or doing business, or you producing something to sell, or you're about to produce something to sell. It is very important for you to look for the best marketing channel that will suit your budget your location or that is in high demand that people would love to use without too much complaint that is what you should target at that is what you should look towards and i already mentioned that marketing channel is a set of people organization and activities they work together is so emphasis on work together because one person can do the job they have to work together to transfer goods products services so it doesn't have to be just be a goods it can be a product it can be a service and from one point of there's a point of origin to the point of consumption meaning the place of production where it was produced to the place where people will end up using what you have produced so that is just basically what it means and i also mentioned that there are four there are four basic types of marketing channel, which is the direct selling, selling through intermediaries, the dual distribution, and the reverse market. In case you do not understand dual distribution, this means that the, the manufacturer sells to customers and also does business with wholesalers and resellers who sell to customers through their own distribution network. So the manufacturer has access to the customers, not only does the cost, not only the retailer or the wholesalers. So, this is the conclusion. In my next video, I'm going to be explaining five digital marketing channels for promoting your products. So, turn on the notification button, subscribe to my channel, check out my other videos. I have amazing videos for you to check out. And this is the conclusion. You can leave a comment, you can leave a like, you can ask questions in the, in the comment section. I will see you on my next video.